All right, let's talk to Athens Seresi. I you killed him. Me good fortune, Outlander. How may I be of service? Tell me I'm Archmaster now. Advancement. You defeated Bolvin Venom in an honorable duel to the death. With two shots, like freaking two shots. You've proven yourself worthy of the title of Archmaster. Congratulations, James Duran. Archmaster of House Redoran. Advancement. I am the Archmaster. Do you have any more duties for me? May the tribunal guide you to use your position widely, wisely. Do you train anything I want? Nope. So I am done with you. I'm done. However, this does give me the opportunity to explore Venom Manor now that the guy is dead. I can't imagine that he's got that much for me to loot, though. I can't imagine it's too much. How you guys doing? Nobody, nobody seems to care. Nobody. Uh, I, I don't know if these are actual NPCs or, once again, mod-added ones, but they didn't have much to talk about since I killed their guy. My time nobody, nobody says anything important. Outland. Like I freaking What's killed you your guy. I, I freaking killed your lord, your dad, your... Uh, I assume that there's a family in here somewhere. Is there anything particularly good here that I can loot? I mean, I, I went through all this before, I know, but... I don't remember if there were any locked doors or anything. I got his key. It's gotta be good for something. I remember there was this door in here. Behind the tapestry. Freaking... Y y you hang a carpet on the wall and it's a tapestry all of a sudden. But, I... I no, apparently... What's the point of his key, then? I, I... I don't understand. I don't understand at all. Yeah, right wing, that's where I was. You may speak. Guard quarters. I, Must say. I'm I don't. I don't understand. I'm just gonna assume that there's nothing here. So it is actually time to continue on with the main quest because I have done what I set out to do. I have defeated everything that they have thrown in my path in both the Mages Guild and House Redoran. It is time to once again speak with the Naked Man. Okay, for those of you that don't remember, because it has been forever since I was here. This is Caius Cosatis's house. When he last left off with Caius Cosatis, he was still naked and he said he needed some time to think about the things that we told him, so we should go do other things. So I did the rest of the game, more or less. Well, some of the rest of the game. Obviously, I haven't done everything. <laughs> I don't know anybody that's ever done everything in this game, to be honest with you. See, he is still naked. At least he's got full-on pants, but still, there's what one leg. That? You're paranoid because you smoke too much skooma. That's what that was. Yes, what are my orders? Oh, a hundred gold. Hooray. I've heard of a fellow in Aldrun named Hasur Zan Subani. An Ashlander who left the waste to become a wealthy trader. They say that Ashlanders like to give and receive presents. Take these 100 drakes, find out what Zansubi, Zansubani li no, likes, and get him a gift. Then give him the gift and see if he'll tell you about the Ashlanders and the Nerevarine cult. They report back to me. Oh, that's right. <laughs> it's still a cult. Totally just a cult. I know nothing about the Nerevarines. Shut up. You guys don't know anything either. Uh, right. He's... Okay, he's at the rat in the pot. I already know where that is. So apparently the next quest in the main quest was going to send me uh, to Aldrun. So, we can just take the silt strider. I mean, this is literally nothing now that I got my boots. These these small little quests are really nothing anymore. Alright, travel. I want to go to Aldrun. And we need to head to the Rat in the Pot, which I already know where that is, because we've been in Aldrin so damn much you already. Thanks to House Redoran. But I do know that, well, everything's going to be a little bit, a little bit, a lot easier than it used to be, now that I have sufficiently leveled up. You, you, know. Yes. No, no. Freaking out of my way. Okay.
if you. I can no. help, I will. But the other guy's dead. That time. was not who was part of the main quest. Sweet. Otherwise, that would have been awkward. Right, you. 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 No. Honor among thieves? Nope. Nothing. The Black Arrow. Probably read these before. What am I doing? No. 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 Damn it, he's got to be around here somewhere. They told me the rat in the pot has Sur Zan Subani. I'm not sure where to find him, but I tried the Outscar Inn. Oh. <laughs> I was reading too quickly. He's at the Outscar Inn, which is not in Scar. I think we've gone over this before. I don't know why, but it's not. I think it's this one right here, actually. The Outscar Inn. Now, we haven't been here too much, but w at least we know he's in here. He's probably in the bottom. Everybody's always in the bottom. No. No, he's up top. No. Damn it. He's hanging out in the back. Of course he's hanging out in the back. That is a long name, but it's not you. There you go. Hasur. Yes. I have business. What is our gift giving? Curious question. A gift is a sign of courtesy among strangers and affection among friends. Among strangers, a thoughtful gift is a sign that you are cautious and considerate and aware of the other's wants and needs. Such as particularly useful for traders and travelers among friends it is a private thing and subtle with great risks. For the test of the gift is how well it is tailored to the receiver. Thoughtful gift. Yes, a gift. That shows you have taken care to learn something in receiver. For example, I love poetry. Now, a stranger can be expected to know this, but a book of poetry given to me by a stranger shows the giver respects me and has made a special effort to know and please me. But now I've answered your question with like some time to myself. And then he goes away. I don't think there's a bookseller in Aldrun. I don't think. I can always look up on the map here. Uh, there is! Right up here. You the bookseller? Sweet. Give me poetry. If you have Walt Whitman, that'd be appreciated. And Garland Poe. I'd even take some Emily Dickinson. And by even take, I mean that's the one I actually want. Poetry. Hymns? Does hymns count as poetry? Uh, songs, confessions, reflections, just regular paper, major guild, mystery, mysterious, lives, guide, 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 frontier, conquest. I don't, I don't see anything that absolutely stands out as poetry to me. Uh, God. What can you tell me about poetry? What does my journal say? He mentioned he loves poetry, then a book of poetry would be a perfect gift. Right. Bookseller, merchant, or pawn shop nearby. I'd and I can't just be like, hey, you, you're a bookseller. Can I just say, do you have any poetry? No. That'd be asking too much of this game, apparently. Ugh. So nothing really stood out as absolutely counting as poetry to me. Maybe the pawnbrokers got some poetry. Welcome, friend. They did say it could be a merchant or the pawnbroker. Uh, what kind of books do you have? You have no books. What the hell is that? It's a. L you have a loot? Why do you have a loot? I guess you're a pawnbroker, but still. Still. Um. Yeah, nothing. I mean, hymns kind of okay. count. What do you want? I think. What are you? A general merchant. Maybe the general merchant has the poetry. Seriously, poetry. You? Oh, it's you. Okay. Do you have any books? Uh, the Wolf Queen. Maybe I. Maybe you're just supposed to read it. And then it'll tell me. God. Where, where is this book? It was an expensive-ass book. 
you don't just have it lying around, that'd be appreciated. Oh, there we go. Ten. Yeah, that's not poetry. Okay, so, uh... Let's just read the books in the bookseller. Why not? I mean, that's what I do in real life when I go to a bookseller. Ancestors. Five songs. No, that is not poetry. Feathers of Darkness. No. Frontier Conquest. A Social History of Cyrodiil University. Mage's Guild. True Nature of Orcs. Less, a less rude song. There we go. Give me a less rude song. That that should count, shouldn't it? Where's the inn? Fuck. <laughs> that was definitely a poem. So you want it. You totally want it, whatever your name was. You. Business. Thoughtful gift. Damn it. Have the book. I have a thoughtful gift for you. Okay, apparently I didn't pick the right freaking book, even though it was clearly poetry. Oh, that's, that's that thing. Ready? This, this is clearly poetry, but no, that's not what he wants. I'm gonna have to go to the rare bookseller again, aren't I? I don't wanna go back there! Okay, uh. The mirror? No, that is not poetry. Mystery, no. This is a volume of verse! Okay, the five far stars. Give me that one as well. The five far stars. And that one. God. Let's go for more. So, folk verses. So, let's go for the Ashland hymns, too. That's more poetry. I don't know which one he wants. But we're getting them all. I don't care about measly little. What, like 100, 200 gold? I don't care. Reflections. Uh, what's the clan? Okay, nope. Okay. I have three books of poetry now. Take one. You like poetry. Pick one. It's thoughtful, damn it. It's thoughtful! Uh, courtesy. Thoughtful gift. He wanted the five far stars. Noble words of noble words are gratefully accept your gift. My people have never loved the written word, and I lament their ignorant scorn for such common yet potent magic. I thank you, and I honor your courtesy, James Duran. It would please me to return your courtesy by answering, What do you wish to know about the Ashlanders? Hooray. And the cults. Okay. So he gave me notes because he doesn't want to, uh... Doesn't want to go over it. But the cult is... They worship the great Ash Khan and Hortator Nerevar Moonenstar, who in ages past destroyed this evil godless dwarves and banished the treacherous Dagath Ur and his foul host beneath Red Mountain. The cult is a small consequential Ashlander wo worship, and only among the Urshilaku... Uh, Northern Ashlands, okay. Ashlanders and foreigners? Okay, so it appears that whatever I need to get from him, I got. He's not giving me all the information that I need, but he gave me at least a little bit of information. We are slowly finding out where the Nerverine is, because we totally don't know who that could be. We have no clue as to the identity of the Nerverine. <sighs> Let's keep going. Back to Aldrin. No, Balmora. <laughs> I know where I'm going. I know where I am. Shut up. We need to go back to Balmora and talk to d naked Chaos Kosatis again, because why not talk to him? He's so much fun to talk to when he's not high on skooma all the damn time. I need to go up here. It's been a while since I had to go to him d regularly, and I've kind of lost track of how to get there. My pleasure, really. Of course it's your pleasure. 
Yes. Thank you, report. But keep the notes, you'll need them. I'm promoting you and sending you to the Urshalaku camp to speak with Sul Matul and Nibane Mesa before you go. I think we have time to tell you what's going on. The Emperor and his advisors think you have the appearance of meeting the conditions of the Nerevarine prophecies. That's why you were pulled out of prison on His Majesty's authority and sent to me. So you could satisfy the conditions of the Nerevarine prophecies and become the Nerevarine. I've already been dubbed that. Here, this is a decoded copy of the coded package you gave me when you arrived. Read it later. It should explain everything. So you'll see in the decoding mission, the Emperor and his counselors say that you have the appearance of satisfying the conditions of the prophecy. Do you really satisfy the prophecy? Are you really the prophesied Nerevarine? At first, I thought we were just supposed to create a per a persuasive imposter. I don't know what to think, but I'm sure of one thing. This is not just primitive superstition, and we will treat it seriously, just as His Majesty commands. So, Zane Subani says Sul Matul and Nabani Mesa at Urshalaku camp are the heads of the Nervarine cult, so I'm sending you to speak with them. Tell them your story and have them test you against the Nervarine prophecies. As heads of the Nervarine cult, they can best judge whether you satisfy the prophecies. When you've spoken with them, report back to me. Here's 200 gold and pick up essential supplies at Fort Moon Moth. Uh, where's this camp? Lies close to the Sea of Ghosts, north of Margon. Okay, the fastest, smartest way to reach is take Silt Strider. Right. So, Margon, um, and then look for a new line of Tedas. She'll be able to sh sh tell you how to reach the camp. Alright, so, we might be the Nerevarine. We don't know. We yes, don't know. Happened. Nobody has told us anything because I played the game out of order. Nobody knows whether or not James Duran, Arch Master. Was it Ar Arch Master? What was it? Damn it. <laughs> Arch Mage, definitely. Arch Master. It was Arch Master. Arch Master. Arch Mage. Stronghold Completionist. Thespian. Master Flower Picker. He might be the Nerevarine as well. We just don't know. We just don't know. We have nothing that could give a hint as to whether or not we are the Nerevarine or not. But we will head out to Margon and find out next time. Hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. I've been Baller Scuba. I've been joined as always by Lord of the Dance. He can't... Okay, he just does the sideways shuffle. He, d he does that kind of well. God, that thing looks awesome. We've been joined as always by James Duran. Hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.